Jackson Jack's investigation has uncovered a fire. JTA bus operator was reinstated despite being called, quote, unsafe by a supervisor. You're watching Fox 30 Action News Jax at 10. I'm Tanika Hughes. I'm John Bachman. Action News Jax started digging into records of all JTA drivers to see if there were any safety concerns after a rider was killed and another bus was hit by a train just weeks apart. New at 10, Action News Jax investigator Christy Turner is live at the downtown station. Christy, the driver was fired for having several preventable crashes. And in this email, a now former JTA supervisor says, quote, it is crystal clear that driver is unsafe. The bus operator appealed that termination twice and was given a second chance. Destiny Coleman relies on JTA services. I take the bus uh, every day and I Monday through Friday to go to work. She says it's concerning a JTA bus operator labeled unsafe by a supervisor in this letter could soon get back behind the wheel. Some people put their children on their buses by themselves and for all the more reason, these drivers need to be careful. Action News Jax is choosing not to name the driver. Records reveal the bus operator was fired in April for being involved in several preventable collisions and incidents, including one where she made contact with a person. In a letter, the president of the Jacksonville Transportation Board says they have been minor in nature. The bus operator was given a second chance. JTA says her overtime hours were scaled back and she was retrained. In a statement to Action News Jax, JTA CEO Nat Ford says after significant efforts to correct issues through training, they placed this bus operator on hold off status as they evaluate next steps. JTA says the bus operator had a 60 day review with a behind the wheel trainer that wrapped up last Friday. The reason she's still not able to drive passengers right now, coming up all new at 11. Reporting live in downtown Jacksonville, Christy Turner, Fox 30, Action News, Jacks.